Hi, my name is Omar Omagrabi. I am a junior at North Carolina Central University, and my major is IT, Information Technology. So my um, music choice from the country of, well, not the country, more of the region of like Persia, India, Pakistan, Bangladesh, and Punjab province. Um, the reason I chose this uh, music genre or this region was because most of my friends are Desis, so you, most I have friends from Pakistan, Bangladesh, and um, uh, India. So that's the reason I picked it. Um, most of their songs are really like soft beat, and some of them are crazy, like rap and all of that. But they all have meetings to it and a whole bunch of stuff. So I do enjoy listening to their type of music. Um, even though I'm from Egypt and we do have similarities, um, but there's this like totally whole entire different dynamics. So um, the first one would be uh, Bari, is from uh, Mamina. Um, talks about, oh, when um when I first saw you and oh um and how you looks and all that was a uh, was astonishing. So in the music they talk about uh how we met and all of that. So um it goes into grave detail about that. Um so and within the music video, um, the lyrics say, as in translation, As I saw you, I lost my senses, which led me to spill the hot tea on my hand. And it was within the music video, he was holding hot tea, and it spilled on his hands when he saw her. He was, like, kind of speechless. Um, within the lyrics, it goes into saying, I also have come to know that you had got heartbroken ones. That's the reason you left no windows open to open your heart, even when he's trying to talk to her and get to know her. So, and within her um, side of the music, it says, I have the desire to fly, but I am so afraid to. Even if I try to fly high, I will need to fight the winds. Um, this fear has made me keep my dreams only to my eyes and led me to lock my heart down in deaths so the song has a, like a lot of meaning to it and background to it it's a very like complex song and that's mostly with all of their songs so you have to like if you don't know the language even just watching the video you will definitely understand what they're talking about it's a lot the other song is Ayanatu which is from the same artist Mamina Koshin but different uh, singer too. His name is Arjan Kanaju. It's kind of like a mix. I think he's from India and she's from Pakistan. But uh, they talk about um, you never said you loved me, blah blah blah, and all that within the lyrics. Um, as in translation, they said you will never say. Why don't you just say it? And he says, um, say where you are. We will come to you. With their training, wherever our paths will cross, um, um, either and within the lyrics it says, "In your arms, where sunset, I came to you." But within her verse, she's like, "But you didn't come," which is the translation of "I ought not to," um, which is probably the best song I ever heard. When you listen to it, it sounds amazing. A lot of romance and. Um, a lot of, uh, complex stuff into it, like I said previously, a lot. Um, so within the other, going down within the lyrics, I say, man, man, awazu, don't take a hun hayan manau. So now, who should I call to? I'm here. I think I'm here, but you're not here. So I guess they're like missing each other <laughs> at different times. Probably busy or not, but um, then it goes to 
I ought not to, I ought not to. But you didn't come. And then it says, I thought that if I met you, I would tell you everything that's in my heart. Um, so yeah, that, that song was very good. And I think um, Mommy and I'm a magician, even with my friends sitting in the car listening to the music. She's a very popular singer. She's very, like an activist and she's very, uh, she's very popular. Um, the sec, the third song is by Jeanette. It's from Izu and Hardship Kaur. Um, it's a mixture, same thing as Pakistani and Indian. Um, I believe Izu is a uh, Muslim and she is Hindi, but it doesn't really matter. They all come from the same region, anyways. Um, within the song, it talks about once I saw you, we connected and all of that. And within the lyrics, as it says, Yesterday my eyes got connected with my beloved. There I saw the gates of paradise. There was a procession of happiness. I also saw the corpses of pain. So I think she's either referring to of her past or something like that. Then the other lyrics, it says, What day, what night, what day, what today, what tomorrow, I'll, I'll have to live in her steps what my set is in front of her and I told her about my feelings for her I have expressed my heart feelings in front of her um, yesterday my eyes got connected with my beloved there I saw the gates of paradise and that's uh, the chorus I believe keeps going back and back and forth with that um, was then her side of the lyrics it says if I don't see him for four days I feel unwell I'm sleepless at night and even if I found my days worthless the eyes of my beloved is to care of an unhealthy person I feel like I started liking the pain and within the watching the video you can see her happy and he is sad and it's just a bunch of uh, romance into it and I think like I said before Desi's Desi music from that region is mostly about romance stuff like that even within the movies um most of the movies that's where the songs get very popular especially from bollywood and all of that tell about a billion people watching that so of course it's very popular even if it's not someone's watching in the uk or if he's an american you can get it and decipher everything it's uh very cool and even for me i'm arab so, I don't understand Urdu, or Telugu, or any of the languages, but after, you know, me and my friends, which are Muslims too, but of course, they don't speak Arabic, they speak Urdu, which is, uh, uh, it's close to Arabic, same written scriptures and everything, but totally different language. Um, I could start picking up words and everything from the music videos, and just watching the music videos without any translation, I can try to get what they're saying so um, yeah now the final song I was gonna talk about and it's I guess the best one out of all the lists it's um, Barish um, same thing same uh, genre it's about romance and all of that um, within the lyrics in the in the beginning in your face I find myself in the midst of my eyes, you are like this, even my dreams can't find a place, this seasonal rain. The rain's water, this water's droplets find you only, this desire to me. This old desire, my story can be fulfilled by you. So I believe every single Desi song or anything has to do something about a girl and a boy. And it's very clean and straightforward. Now, much as the Americans, the uh, hard language to it and all of that, um, they show some type of respect into it too. So um, I think they're very great songs. Um, uh, yeah, most of the songs are very like you know, no no foul language, no explicit stuff onto it. Now this song is uh. Pretty different, it's from the Punjab region, 
into the disputed area between India and Pakistan. Um, very disputed between uh, causes of confrontations between the two regions. Um, the artist is a quote AP Delon. It's a pretty upbeat um, hip hop, but romance into it too. Um, within, the in, within the lyrics, it says, as in the translation, "Oh, the one that gives giving excuses to my heart, you will find out when your heart breaks too." We're taking care of a broken heart, and what's the use of that girl? Um, we are remembering you with every breath. If someone else will do the same, then we'll know. Oh, the one that giving excuses to my heart. Um, out of all the songs. This one's pretty upbeat, you know, um, kind of a uh, goes back and forth between both of them. It's pretty good song. Uh, so yeah, in conclusion, uh, Desi music within that region is really good music. I recommend people to listen to it. A lot of romance, mostly all of it romance because of the movies and Bollywood and and most of the mu music spins off of movies off of Bollywood. So, um, it's very, very good music. Um, thanks!